Hello, I am thrilled to be with you today to talk to you about one of my favorite sets in the Celebration brochure. I love the A Happy Thing stamp set. Now this is one of the sets that you can earn during Celebration with a qualifying order. So make sure you get that catalog out, take a look at things so that you can uh, earn this set. I love that we have a couple of different images here that you can use with blend abilities. I think it's just so much fun to be creative with them. And I just think it's so much fun. I love the card that was created with this. And I wanted to show you how to create the layered look that we have because obviously there's only one lemon and we want to have a whole branch of them. So I'm going to set this aside and this aside. I've already pulled the lemon stamp set out of there. Now what you need in order to do masking, you need to have an image that you've cut out that is ex that's an exact replica of, of the um, stamp. We usually use for this a very thin paper. Um, I don't recommend tissue paper, uh, but it's more like typewriter paper. It's not cardstock. Cardstock is a little bit too heavy and you, ha you don't get the look that you want. So you have to stamp that and then cut it out. Now I've already stamped one image there. If you look at this, it's going to be this one that's on top. Now the next one I'm going to stamp is the one to the side and then I'll stamp this one that's underneath it. So the first thing I need to do is mask this current image off because I don't want to stamp on top of it. So I'm just going to, I took that, take that mask. If you're on, if you want to be really confident, you can put a little bit of adhesive on there. I usually don't get that fussy about it. And I'm just going to ink that up with my Memento ink pad because we're going to use blendabilities. And I want to layer this lemon down a little. And even though I'm stamping it on top, it's going to look like it's beneath the lemon that was on top of it. Okay? Yep, it is magic. I hope that's exactly how you feel. Now we're going to do one more to the side, so I'm going to you move my mask over here. Now let me ink this up again. Okay. And this one I want to be up just a little bit higher. So I'm just going to pull him up about right here. Okay. And you can see that I've got a cluster of lemons. Okay. Now there are lots of videos about blending. Um, with blend abilities. Basically, my biggest tip is I always start with light and then go to dark. My feeling is you can always make it darker, but you can't make it lighter. And I actually usually leave an entire section without any color. Okay, so that's just my one layer. I can't leave you unfinished with this, so let's just add another layer in there. Going back through here. And of course, I'm going to do this with all of my layers of lemons in here. Now I know they're lemons, although I do like a good pear. All right, and then the, the dark, I'm really just gonna use very, very, very little of it, mostly just to accent. Then of course, I can go back in, back to my lightest, and pull some more of that color in if I want to. I feel like I've got a little too much white in there. All right, then I'm just gonna repeat that with my other three lemons. And I'm going to have a card that looks just like that and deserves to be in a celebration brochure. I hope you love this stamp set and that you'll do everything you can to earn it. Thanks for tuning in today. Bye-bye.